Hello, this is the Radio Geek, and today I have the Electro Brand model 4610 on the inside. As you may recall in a previous video, I kind of demonstrated the functionality of this AM FM clock radio that I bought of 10 plus years ago. Well, I popped it open to see what was inside, and uh, I found this guy here is a LM8560, which is a alarm clock, digital alarm clock chip with the LED driver built in. So it's the uh, alarm function and drives the LED display uh, as well. And you can see there's just one uh, cable coming from the board right to this display and the display is all, all one piece. And then over here, this one here is the CD2003GP which is a um, AM FM radio chip. And then back in here, which is a little hard to see, it's like a little 8-pin IC, is the TDA2822, uh, which is uh, a low voltage uh, audio power amp. So that uh, has your uh, amplification there. You got a very, uh, very small um, ferry bar antenna here, not uh, not too big, uh, but it does an adequate job for um, the AM band anyway. And then you've got your variable cap here, um, a few uh, cans, IF can. Um, you've got our um, power transformer over here, and our very small speaker here. That's probably a, I don't know, an inch and a half. <laughs> maybe across there but the interesting thing here is if you get that out of the way there's a black wire right here which goes up over and then it's just wrapped around the power cord that's the um, FM antenna so basically what they're doing is they're coupling that FM antenna to the power cord so essentially um, the, the power cord here will become your FM antenna so the uh, FM wires just wrapped around here coiled around the power cord and then it makes its uh, connection over here on the circuit board so I thought that was uh, pretty interesting how they did that um, I suppose that's kind of an old trick um, the buttons for the time and the alarm are actual real tactile um, switches um, momentary switches um, so those are kind of nice. Um, all in all, it's uh, it's not too bad for a cheap, inexpensive um, radio anyway. But anyway, I just thought I'd uh, give you a quick look in the inside and uh, see what it looks like. I don't suspect there's a whole lot on the other side. It looks like pretty much just um, through-hole components. So there's probably just some traces on the bottom side. Nothing probably too interesting there. But anyway, um, this is a look on the inside of the Electro brand model 4610. Until next time, this is the Radio Geek.